What's up travelers? I am at Il Salato here in Milan, Italy. Just steps away from the Milan Cathedral. We're getting lunch, a Milanese specialty. But before we do that, uh, go check out the surroundings a little bit. We are now entering the Galleria Vittorio Emmanuel II. It's the oldest active shopping mall in Milan and it was built between 1865 and 1877. It was then named after the first king of the Kingdom of Italy. This is the four-story tall double arcade in the middle of town. And it has a roof made of iron and glass. This place is absolutely stunning. This statue here, in my opinion, is the coolest statue in Milan that is outside of 
the Cathedral of Milan. This statue was built to honor one of the greatest inventors and artists of all time. His name is Leonardo da Vinci. I am at Il Salato here in Milan, Italy, just steps away from the Milan Cathedral. We just ordered a Milanese specialty, cotola kettle alla Milanese con rucola e grana, a veal cutlet with, they call it rocket here, we call it arugula. <laughs> And then it also has Parmesan. It should be a pretty good meal. I've been looking forward to this one for quite a while. Hopefully it is delicious. Here we have it. This is a, a nice veal filet. Came with some arugula, some Parmesan cheese, a nice, a nice chunk of lemon here. It's all pretty fied. <laughs> yeah, it, it's basically it's based on the German Wiener Schnitzel, uh, which is usually pork, but this is veal, a rib steak that's been pounded out. Yeah, let's just dig in. So the breading is nice and crunchy, and mealy, kind of like the, the meal like when you have cornmeal and it's just All of just a wonderful flavor. It's really tender, extremely thin, but oh man, this is this is worth what we're paying for it. Uh, this cost us 28 euros. Everything in Milan is absolutely just out of this world crazy expensive. <laughs> I really can't wait to get out of it. <laughs> Not that the city is bad. It's a beautiful city. Just expensive. When I added the lemon, it just it really made it pop it just that much more. All right, let's try piece of this cheese here with some of the 
rocket, as they call it, or rocket. Mm. Everything that you want from a Parmesan cheese. Add a little bit of this olive oil to the salad. Well, I'd say this is probably a tourist trap considering where it's at. But as I was doing my research, quite frequently what I ordered at a lot of places it's about twice as expensive so I'm not complaining too much <laughs> the reason why I ended up coming here is I'm waiting for the rooftop of the cathedral to open because it's iced over uh, the joys of traveling in December <laughs> But hopefully after I'm done eating, I'll be able to go in and go see the top of the cathedral. The inside is just amazing. Absolutely breathtaking. Would I suggest coming here for this meal? I would say it's a it's pretty good if you're in a situation where you're over by the cathedral and uh, you're hungry. This is a pretty decent spot to go. I don't think I'd come out of my way to come here. I bet there's better restaurants not too far from here. Another thing you can get from uh, this meal around town, you can get it as venison, you can get it as pork. There are also cutlets that are about that thick that you can run into. Those are the ones that are going to really price you out of, out of Italy. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. If it's been of use to you at all, if you've enjoyed this video or just didn't, had fun watching uh, please give me a like a subscribe hit that notification bell if you feel the need and I will make sure that you get a notification every time that I upload a new video but as always <laughs> man we're doing this with salad eat great food <laughs>